Hello everyone, uh, this is just a quick little tutorial of about how to schedule your tweets in TweetDeck and also um, schedule tweets along with images in TweetDeck. So let's get started. You should have the plus sign as an icon here on the left side of your TweetDeck. All right, uh, if you click add column, you can click search and then whatever the hashtag is, whatever the chat name, whatever it is, you could type it in. So we're going to type in MEMSPA chat for the Michigan Elementary and Middle School Principals Association chat, which is Thursdays at 8 p.m. So we're going to do hashtag M-E-M-S-P-A chat, and we're just going to hit enter. It's as simple as that. So I just created a column by, you can see the column numbers. I have four, five, six. Right underneath them, you have a couple lines, and now that four uh, piece cursor comes up. If you click right there, you can actually drag your column wherever you'd like it. So it's always really nice to have your column um, if you're moderating the chat, following the chat, right on your screen. And also it's really nice, I'm going to move my notifications column right next to it. So when people notify you during the chat, it's really nice to kind of keep an eye on both of those columns. All right. Now, in order to send a tweet and schedule it out, it's also quite simple. You just go over here to create a new tweet. All right. And if you're the moderator or if you are, um, you know, just creating a tweet, if you're the moderator and your question one is, um, what's your favorite color? I'm just going to use that as an example. What is your favorite color? Got to make sure that, of course, you put the hashtag of, you know, the, the, the chat in your tweet somewhere. Um, often as a moderator, it's nice and easy to create your questions ahead of time on a Google Doc or a Word document or something like that. And then just copy and paste them in here. Okay, so if you have your six questions ready to go, your eight questions ready to go, or however many um, tweets you have ready to go. Some people have um, 20 scheduled tweets that they have throughout the the hour chat or something like that. You can create a document ahead of time, copy and paste them all in here and schedule them. And once again, it's very easy to schedule. Once you have your, your tweet copy, paste, or typed in here, you just go to schedule tweet. When you click schedule tweet, you can schedule for any time you want to go out. So if that's question one on Memspa chat and I want it to go out at 8.08, .08, I'm just going to change the time. 8.08 .08, on Thursday, April 23rd. Okay. I can click up here and it says once again, tweet at 8.08, 8.08, Thursday, um, April 20th or April 23rd. And there you go. If you want to add an image, you can also add an image. It'll also tweet out one graphic image as well. Okay. Whatever your image might be, you got to have those images obviously saved in your computer. Um, I'll just select this one. And once again, you have your question, you have your image and you have it scheduled. Uh, when you schedule your tweets, you can only add one image at a time, all right? Only one image at a time. So to set that, though, all you need to do is click Tweet at 8.08, .08, and TweetDeck will save it, and it will automatically tweet that at 8.08 .08 p.m. So that's kind of nice. And also a nice feature is that you have a scheduled column here in your tweets. So we just created that Tweet 8.08 .08 p.m., Thursday the 23rd, right here. It's scheduled right here. It's really nice to kind of keep an eye on that column as well. I'll move that over to the side just so you know what tweets are coming up next. Okay. So you'll see your question one, question two, and so on and so forth. All right. So that's a quick tutorial about scheduling your tweets, adding a graphic, um, adding a column, anything you want. Um, any questions I know, please reach out to me on my YouTube channel or my email or just, hey, nowadays, search, just search me on Google. Thanks, everyone.